Welcome to Trussell Sports Television. I'm Grayson. And I'm Jake. Russell Sports Television is a way for students like Jake and I to share our knowledge and passion for sports like football, football baseball, basketball, soccer. Jake. All right, man. Okay. Anyways, let's get to what we were supposed to talk about. Like I was saying before, we as a cast want to show our youth ministry a deeper look into sports as a whole around the city of Trustful. We will be conducting interviews with coaches and athletes, provide statistical analytics, all while incorporating the events that happen within our church. Our goal as Trustful Sports Television is to provide a different means for students to experience sports around Trustful. Jake. Oh, um, now that you've heard all that, let's get into our first segment. This segment is what we like to call Yesterday, Today, and Tomorrow. It is a brief breakdown of the sport of the day's past, present, and future actions as a team. The sport of the day is football. Last season, the Huskies exceeded our expectations, going all the way to the second round of the state playoffs, falling to an absolute powerhouse of a team known nationwide as the Hoover Buccaneers. Unfortunately, the Huskies also suffered a great loss of leadership when Hewitt Trustful class of 2018 graduated, leaving a gap for leaders such as Paul Tyson, Zalen Worsham, and many others to fill. We firmly believe that these players will exceed our expectations and make the season the best season in Hewitt Trustful football history. Not only do we have the star players that Jake mentioned, we also have new arrivals such as sophomore running back Armani Goodwin, senior wide receiver Javaris Johnson, and senior defensive back Alante Porter. These new acquisitions will provide more support for our team. Another big change to the Hewitt Trussell program is that we've entered a more competitive region, Region 3. This new crop of talent that the Huskies have acquired have accumulated multiple star scholarship opportunities such as LSU, Oregon, Auburn, Tennessee, and most notably, the University of Alabama. I think you guys know what my pick would be. Now let's get into our first interview with five-star offensive lineman and Under Armour All-American, Pierce Quick. All right, uh, my name's Nasir, this is Davis. We're here to interview the main man here, Pierce Quick. Um, we got a couple questions for you, are you ready? Yes. All right, sounds um, good. So I'll start off with the first one. So uh, Pierce, you're going into your senior year. You got a lot of accolades. You got a lot of college offers. You're going to Alabama. You're uh, Twitter famous. Uh, all the ladies love you. It's your senior year. So your intensity in training games, how different is that from freshman year at Square? You know, honestly, it's more intense now than it was freshman year just because freshman year I wasn't really sure what I wanted to do. You know, I knew I wanted to play sports, but I wasn't completely bought in as to where now, like, I'm sold into it. I'm doing football. So the training's a little bit more intense now just because I know that's my goal. Uh, that's good to hear. Great to hear the fan. Uh, on to the next question. After summer workouts with the season being so close, what are you most excited for? Uh, the first game on ESPN. You know, I've never got to play on ESPN yet, and so like that's an honor right now. And so to play my first game on ESPN with all my boys, that's going to be awesome. That is awesome. All right. Uh, why the Alabama Crimson Tide? Well, you know, I grew up a huge Alabama fan. Ever since I was a kid, I've been going to Alabama games with my family and just like I mean, that's what I grew up with, and I mean, it helps that they win a lot, and it's close to home, and so I feel like it'll, you know, I'll have a bunch of friends there. So, um, in this upcoming season, what team are you most looking forward to playing against? Um, honestly, that's a tough question because there's a lot of teams, but being back in this new region, I'm just looking forward to play this whole region, in a, you know, in a nutshell, like just playing this whole region. Okay. Uh, so, on Twitter, you have a lot of interactions with different people and you seem to get a lot of mentions with popular athletes. How much uh, interaction do you have with these guys outside of Twitter? Do you like have phone numbers and make phone calls out there and stuff? Yeah, so um, I have a lot of their numbers. You know, most of the guys are out of state, so I don't really get to see them that much, but I text with them a lot. I wouldn't say we go to dinner that much, but yeah. uh, we text a lot and stuff like that. You know, I'm just telling them, come to Alabama and all that stuff. So, uh, so Pierce, I've got, I've got a serious question for you. Um, how often do you cry, bro? Oh, shoot, man. 
Probably every day. Every day. I cry myself to sleep. <laughs> That's an emotional <laughs> man. <laughs> I'm a very emotional man. All right, this is a this is a two part question. This is a championship team. All right. That being said, we uh, formally like to invite you in a later episode to we'll get you on camera. You can shave your head if when we make the championship, just to show your devotion to this team and just how proud you are. You, you don't have to say yes now, but it's just the the. <laughs> that's a tough it's, one. It's, I, it's, it's I, I, I leave it's for college in December. Yeah. So that'd be like right after the season. And I don't know if I want to go in with a buzzed head. Yeah, we can. Because I'm pretty confident we're going to win state. So that'd be a, you know. Making a statement. Yeah, making a statement. State, state yeah. championship. I mean. You know, maybe we get Paul. Yeah, we'll talk to you. <laughs> oh, we'll talk to you. Yeah. Yeah, we'll, 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 we'll get Paul. We'll get Paul. Um, so, so, you know, you got, a, you got a team with a lot of big guys on it. So, uh, who on the team do you think you could eat more hot wings than? Oh, anybody. I'd take anybody on the team. Me, and, me and Wings, I'd take Tank. Me and Wings. I already took Tank in the ice cream competition. Oh, oh, oh I yeah, I already yeah, took yeah, him there. Yeah. Like, Tank, you don't understand. I can eat some wings. I can put them back. How many wings could you eat in one sitting? In one sitting? Mm-hmm. Honestly, I've never tried, but the most I've ever ate was 45. Where's but, your go-to place? Uh, Buffalo Wild Wings. Sorry for your bank account. Here, so. Yeah, but <laughs> there's one guy that could have beat me, and it was BC. Oh, 80, 80 boneless wings. I sat there and watched him eat it at Hooters. 80. <laughs> Like sat there like <laughs> All right, and then uh, one more question. You seem like a very intellectual man. I'm sure you've taken plenty of science classes. With all the information that you have, is the Earth flat? No. Um, that, wow, that's that's, 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 that's the, the, that's the most bold statement we've heard the whole definitely time. Said, definitely around. So uh, we've got it here. Yeah. Pierce Quick says. Pierce Quick. The Earth is round. Man yeah. of the year. Well, just think about this. This building isn't flat. I guess we'll leave it at that. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in to Sports Television. We'll see you next time. Appreciate it, guys. Great interview. And now on to Preston for the pick of the week. Thanks, Jake. This is a big time out of state game for the Huskies, with a lot of big names playing in this game. My two main players to watch are Desalen Warsham and Jaden Hazelwood. Desalen is a four star recruit committed to the University of Alabama and Jaden's a five-star recruit committed to Georgia. These are two big players that you're going to want to watch on the field this weekend. My pick for this game is the Huskies. Now on to Jack for stats. Thanks, Preston. I'm Jack here with stats for you, and today we got two big matchups coming up this weekend. Number one is Jaden Hazelwood. He's a wide receiver for Cedar Grove. He's the number three overall recruit in the country, so he's pretty good. Uh, he's 6'3", 180, and he's got a 34-inch vertical, and he's going up against Malachi Moore, who is the number 201 overall recruit in the country. He's 6'1", 175, but he has a 36-inch vertical. So while they're just about the same size and Jaden's just a little bit taller, when they go up in the air, they're being right here because Malachi's got a two-inch higher vertical. Uh, both these players are very good, and Jaden's committed to Georgia, and Malachi's committed to Bama, which is the schools you want to be in for the state that they're in. And also we got Rashad Chinney. He's a defensive end for Cedar Grove. He's number 45 overall defensive end in the country. He is 6'3", 270, and he squats 240 pounds. Going up against Pierce Quick, who's the number one or number nine overall offensive tackle in the country. He's 6'5", 280, but the difference between him and Chinny is he squats 405 pounds. So he squats a lot more, got big legs, going to push him back in the line. Uh, two other notable things, uh, Cedar Grove has five people who play both on offense and defense, one of them being Hazelworth. He also plays corner, so he'll go up either against DeZalem Worsham or Javarius Johnson. And also, Max Preps has Cedar Grove as the number 77 overall team in the country, and they got Hewitt Trustful as the number 82 overall. So it should be really close, should be a really good game. Looking forward to it. Now back to Grayson and Jake in the studio. Thanks for those stats, Jack. Oh, uh, thanks for watching Trustful Sports Television. Let's send it to... Uh, Simon Says. Hey everybody, welcome to Simon Says. I'm Connor Simon and I serve on the student team here at First Baptist Church Trustful. We have Wednesday night church from 6 to 8 every Wednesday, breakfast Sunday on September 2nd, and compassion on September 5th. Hope to see you at all of our events. Thanks for watching Trustful Sports Television.